it's a really neat place. I think it's amazing. The St. Louis Teachers Recycle Center has been in existence for over 24 years. It is where we go to corporations and we get materials that they don't have a use for. We want to keep it out of the landfill and we want people to be able to have new and creative things to take to the classroom. St. Louis Teacher Recycle Centers, they're the intersection where our donors' material meets our clients. We get materials in the hands of teachers that have no budgets. We charge by the pound, essentially. So for a $10 service fee, that'll entitle you to 10 pounds of goods out of our store. It's gonna round to nine pounds. I've been coming to the Recycle Center for about 10 years now. What place will you find different items and resources all in one spot? At Nestle Purina Pet Care, we believe in reuse and recycle. We've donated t-shirts, We've donated tubs, we've donated binders and miscellaneous office supplies. The kids make things out of them. It could be for like an organized project, like we read a book and we wanted to problem solve for some of the characters, so we tried to make things that the characters could use to solve their problems. Creativity is stimulated, fostered in the classroom for both the teacher and the students when you have materials that have open-ended opportunities. Play Your Art Out, it's about the process of art making. You're like free to be whatever you want, make whatever you want. Play is just highly important to everyone. It allows you to exercise the mind, your thoughts, your ideas. So it's great to have a place like this that will support the play for not just children, but adults too. You can build and paint and create whatever you want to. I make a lot of creations using blocks and wood. It opens up another train of thought. They're bringing out the creativity here with these materials, but they will eventually will transpire over, hopefully, into another medium of life. What are you going to use these um, green and yellow things for? Play takes children to the edge of what they know. Because when the materials are in your hands, it engages your heart and your mind in order for it really to make connections with their intelligence and with their thinking. Everybody gets one candle. It's totally different stuff than normally what I play with. It's not a bounce house. It's all about being reflective. We really want our children to be prepared for what is to come, so we need to open those doors and give them multiple possibilities and opportunities to develop the ways of uh, thinking that we hold important. If you don't bring your classroom in here, they're definitely missing out on a very great opportunity.